Hey, welcome. Welcome to another edition of In the Lab with Loctite. Today we're going to talk about a pretty cool product. It's called Threadlock. Now, I've used Threadlocker a lot over my career. And I'll tell you what, it's a great product. The only problem is I have no idea how it works. So what we're going to do is we're going to bring in an applications engineer. So Andrew, why don't you come in here and join me and let's talk a little bit about Threadlocker. Awesome. Yes, let's awesome. do it. Awesome. Great. So uh, I've seen the product. I've worked with the product. Why don't you explain a little bit about the uh, scientific part of it? <laughs> well, a thread locker is an anaerobic adhesive. Yeah, okay, let's stop right there. Let's uh, <laughs> let's explain anaerobic first. So anaerobic means without oxygen. So this product cures in very tight gaps and also in gaps that have active metal ions. Oh, okay, great. So um, where do these gaps come from? Because what I understand is you take a, a bolt and a nut and you put them together, there's no gap there, they're threaded, right? So actually between an average class two bolt only has about 15% metal engagement on it. Really? So there's a lot of gap in between the area between the nut and bolt. Wow, I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. That's good to know. Now, so this also helps out for what? For vibration, for... Exactly. Okay, great. So it makes sure that nothing comes apart until you take it apart. Okay, let's do this. Yes. All right. <laughs> so we got the blue here. So I'm gonna yep. open this thing up. All right, we pop that up. Yep. Got, okay, and you so just take a, a few drops and apply yep. it to where the nut engagement area will be. Okay, so if the nut's gonna be about halfway off, then mm -hmm. that would be the area that I would apply. Yep, all and right. you only need to apply it on the top there because as you're screwing the nut on, it's going to make sure the product gets all the way around. We're gonna throw a nut on there. Bring that right up in there. So as I'm, I'm putting this nut over that thread locker, what's happening? So what it is is spreading it out over the, the bolt and making sure that you have full coverage area where there's engagement. All right, great. All right, so we got it together. It's been sitting there for four or five years. So how do I get it apart? It's all rusted. For a blue product like the 243, all you need to do is use regular hand tools in order to get it apart. Really? You want to try it out? So this is one that was put together with 243 and then put in a very corroded environment. All right, take a look at that. Can you see that? We got a uh, nice nut and bolt here. It's been, uh, looks like underwater for quite a long time. All right, so this one's got the thread locker on it. Correct. All right, so we're going to put it in this little contraption here. So that one should come off just... Let's see if we can get it off. That right. should come off just as smoothly as if you assembled it and put it in a non-corrosive environment. All right, here we go. Oh man, wow, that's actually pretty easy. A lot easier than I thought it would be. And then what you can see here is that that product prevented any corrosion from happening in that engagement area. So you can see how it still looks like steel and there is no corroded rust as you There's see. There's absolutely rest of no rust where that thread locker is. Yep, was. so any wow. place that you use thread locker, it's gonna prevent any kind of rust or other corrosions from creeping up or creeping into your assembly. Wow, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. You got another one there? What's this yeah. one here? This has no thread locker. Ugh. Wow. Look at that, I think I broke it. Wow, what a difference that is. That is amazing. Absolutely yeah, so amazing. that corrosion really got in there and rusted those bolts together. Wow, that's awesome. <laughs> well, thank you very much. Learned a lot today. Thank you. <laughs> All righty, and that was another episode of In the Lab with Loctite. Thank you, and we'll see you next time. For everyone watching, if you have any questions on this topic or any other topics that you would like to see explained on future segments, just call the Henkel Technical Information Line at 1-800-LOCKTYPE.